there's a difference between meritocracy and a need for actual science. Those are two different things, right? Right, right. But let's 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 because that's going to take us away if we went off. No, course. I, I'm just saying I agree with it shouldn't be touched because you should have representation for the demographics of your country. Makes complete sense. Uh, that's a completely different argument argument than meritocracy. Uh, yes, but any like the point is, this stuff matters. It's worth your time if you're a doctor, if if you're an entrepreneur, if you're someone considering opening a site. It's worth your time to figure this out, because there you have, in my opinion, a good potential rewards from doing this, and that's because there is a need. Um, and still, in 2025. Less than 10% of U.S. sites are part of a network. So 90% of sites are standalone, whether they are dedicated research sites, like with not embedded or embedded or a combo. It's still 90% of sites are not part of a site network. So you have plenty of rewards. There's a li very liquid market willing to buy you out, willing to roll you up, uh, Willing to, if you want to be the platform like us, be the platform and start doing it. So, but you, but you do have to be semi successful, right? You can't just start of a course. clinic, have one study, and somebody's going to buy you. That's not going to happen.